I am Heather Connor. My name is Marisa Indat. My name is Taylor Atwood. My name is Megan Scalin. I am competing at Spokane, Washington at the USA Powerlifting Raw National. It's always nerve wracking. You know, I have a lot of people ask me, do you ever get nervous? Of course I do. I, I get nervous just thinking about it. I mean, it's the same jitters I got when I first started, the same ones I get before any, any open squat. which was my first attempt. I missed on depth, <laughs> which it, it kind of threw me back. I haven't missed a squat attempt in quite some time, but I'm just one of those sticklers. I want to stick to the same weight. I chose it for my second attempt and nailed it. Uh, so 281 was good for my second. And then my third attempt squat, we ended up going with just 292 for three white lights on that as well. There was a little bit more anxiety going into squats because I knew like I needed to hit all three lifts to give me a lead over Tina. Because Tina Danishman is my biggest competition in the US. She's really strong and I knew not going in at my best, if she came in at her best, it would definitely be a battle. So I was just more worried about hitting depth and Chad just kept telling me, no doubt depth, you can do this. Let's just make one lift at a time. So we, what we were projecting 280. Uh, so we opened up with 255 and that absolutely flew. energy levels we wanted to keep at a pretty constant level and we still were able to achieve an American record and an unofficial world record. Squat's you're good. No, you're known for a, a, yeah, a good no. squat. I'm known for a good spot. Yeah. yeah. Uh, squat, it's one of my best lifts. Uh, it's been going pretty well. The first, or the only lift that I missed was actually my third squat. Um, it was 180 in kilograms, so now I'm going back. But, but uh, it was something that I could hit on some days, but it wasn't there last night. Um, looking back at it, like something I wish I hit, but it definitely gives me fuel for fire next time. Uh, 
uh, bench this cycle has probably been my strongest. Yeah, you know, bench warm-ups felt great. I turned very well. I went three for three. So first attempt with 180 felt amazing. shifted down just a little bit and for me when that bar path deviates even just a centimeter it kind of throws off um, throws off the lift for me and unfortunately I didn't make it came back and hit it on my third though and I'm really glad I honestly think I pressed right as he said press so I, I timed it very perfectly and thankfully I got the three whites on that so 180 felt great 190 that moved very well but it didn't move as quickly as we wanted it to. Uh, so we went our 3B attempt, which was 193. about my numbers anymore and it's been the best thing for me. Um, so I had no idea where anyone else was and was just focusing on controlling what I could and doing what I could and letting the cards fall where they were. I knew if I put together a meet that it was the best of my ability that I would, should be okay. For nationals, again, if I go nine for nine, there's no one that I feel can beat me. So for deadlift, um, I have set the bar pretty high on myself with four times the body weight, and the goal is still to maybe chip that, but we are definitely going to see what my body can do today. So. Nine for nine. Nine for nine, go with them.